Hey there everyone, it's me Silent and in our today's tutorial we will be learning how to create 3D text for your anime headers. So without any further ado, let's get into the video. First of all select your font and create the text. After that like rasterize it and change its perspective like the way you see in the video. It has to be set according to your header and all you know. So after like spend some time to set it up perfectly in a like 3d sort of way so when we put extrude and stuff it looks good all right now let's create an empty layer and first of all let me just put it in a folder and create an empty layer and put it under that text layer and then put extrude perspective on it with like complete black color selected and after that create another empty layer above the text this time and select the stroke effect in a, we will be putting in a stroke basically mostly after that create another empty layer and use extrude again but this time it's this layer is below the stroke layer so we are giving the stroke effect extrude to make this shadow effect on the text you know with complete black and just adjusted the extrude a bit after that let's just bring our render in the game so let's put it like that after that change its like color by putting a gradient map on it like that to match the header color theme then put it right above the uh, white text layer and clip it as well as the uh, stroke extrude layer after that set its perspective according to your liking then put some noise effect on it to add some extra texture and all just copy the settings after that let's create a new empty layer and change its blend mode to add and then add some glow effect using airbrush triangle and like add glow effect over the yellow parts with the yellow color and like white pa uh, white parts with white color it just adds a lot to the text and all it really looks really good in the end result that's why and then adjust this up acidity according to your liking then i am just pulling out uh, i'm creating another copy of the text and duplicating after that invert it and like change it to grayscale so it's black and white after inversion and then set it according to your liking the perspective and all that that looks good to me oh shit uh, okay perfect then you can duplicate it and add some gaussian blur and change its perspective to add to to make it a bit glowy and all that always looks good and change its opacity as well according to your liking After that I adjust the render again cause I wasn't like really happy with it. So we will have to change the brush to the, I mean the glow effect again. So let's remove the previous one the white parts and all and adjust them to the new setup. And with that your text effect is ready. Uh, thanks a lot for watching and see you in the next one. Bye bye.